I'm back for part two. Um, I'm Granny Josie. Welcome to my channel. Anyway, I'm going to start with um, a Liz Claiborne uh, bracelet. Hopefully it focuses okay. Very, very pretty. Has a fold over clasp in good condition. Has beautiful little stones. Um, I know they're not plastic. They look like gemstones. Okay, and then um, there is a, a necklace that's signed PD Crown. And I looked that up and that's for Premier Design. And it's kind of a neat little necklace. Not particularly my taste, but this, I think after it's cleaned up, it's not really discoloration, I think it just needs to be cleaned. This is signed Ogami. Um, never heard of it, if anyone's heard of it. It's got a toggle clasp in the middle. It's really different. I have a feeling Somebody added this, added the cross to it, because then it has a lobster clasp. So if you just want the chain, you can actually remove that. But it, it is different. But actually, it's very nice. The cross has rhinestones. And that's pretty nice. And this is, it's signed KC. And it, it's a set. It actually has earrings to match. Isn't that pretty? Metal's nice on it. Here are the earrings. Her pierced ears. Anyway, that's very nice. And Nepnir um, earrings are Screw back. These are definitely vintage with a faux pearl. They're very nice. They do need some cleaning. The metal in the back looks really good, but the pearl looks a little dirty. Not bad though. They look, they'll clean up good. And these are sterling silver. So, Vintage uh, screw back earrings. And there, well, like I said, everything in this box is marked. And by the way, if there's between part one and part two, if there's anything in there that you would like to purchase, um, leave me a message in the bottom of the, in the comment area of the video. Uh, I am going to work on making uh, jewelry jars tomorrow, and a few of these pieces will go into the jars. But if you let me know ahead of time, I will sell them to you separately. This is a neat necklace, Sarah Coventry. Has little hearts. I know someone on YouTube that loves hearts. Isn't it? Isn't that beautiful? It's really cute. Very dainty. Very nice. And let's see. We got some earrings. I am glad there's something else besides necklaces in this lot. Oh. Hmm. Well, I'm sorry to say this one's broken. These were really neat. I guess they will go in the craft lot because the back of that is broken. That is a shame. Okay. That happens, but that's it's still a wonderful lot. I'm not going to complain because there's two pieces that are not good. And this is ETC. The black metal and it has 
Well, the back of it, yeah, it's the little black, black stones. I'm not really fond of black jewelry. I mean, black stones like that, but somebody might like it. This is La Sophia. We've got a lot of her pieces. And this is kind of neat. Very pretty. It's on a, a rope. Nice, actually the, the chain, the rope chain doesn't look worn. It looks nice. And let's see, here's a big piece of Monet. Oh, this is unusual. It's actually very nice and in good condition. Doesn't feel close, uh, cold to the touch. I think it's probably just plastic, but it is very attractive. Again, with a black dress, it would look classy. And let's see, this is signed Aldo. And it is a bracelet, a small bracelet. Let's see, I have a small wrist, so yeah, there's plenty of room. That's pretty cute, pretty cute. I have a lot of the La so Sophia. Here's another one. And this, this is black, but I like this. Very, very long. Very, very pretty. Yeah, that's kind of nice. And let's see here. What is this? This is Monet. Another gold and white beads. Nothing spectacular, but some people like these. Not my taste, but you know what? Not everybody likes the same things as we like, right? So we have to think about that. This is T-E-R-E-N-O. Wow, this is different. Yeah, look at that. Never seen a clasp like that. Feels like rubber, actually. That is, hmm. Somebody might like that. You can always tell when I'm not real crazy about something. I don't hide it very well. This is Vendom. This looks very vintage, very old. Oh, wow. It's a very good brand. These are very dirty, but I will clean them up and they will look nice. These are definitely vintage. Some peeling of the pearls. Yeah, there's some peeling. This is very nice, but um, I will either sell it separately and explain that there's a lot of wear or I'll put it in the craft lot. I do not put things like that in my jars. Okay, here is a brooch that says star. It's kind of neat. Kind of neat. Hmm. Metal is very nice on it. It's in good condition. And here is the pendant with long chain and it's signed AEO. 
it's in, it's in good condition. I would put that in the jar. There's some pearls that are signed Roman. You know, they're faux pearls, but these are out of a bronze color. They're actually very pretty. But the metal, it doesn't, it doesn't look like these have been worn. These are really pretty. I kind of like those. And here's another Romans, and it is a stretch bracelet, and it has the little hang tag on it. Lots of stretch. It's in very good condition. Okay, we're getting towards the end. So I was really happy with this lot. This is Chico's. This feels like leather. Not too bad. Again, not my taste, but you know, we all have different tastes. And this is another, oh, this is Chaps. It's in, looks like it's never been worn, actually. That's nice. That can go in the jar. I just try to put pieces that are in good condition, no missing stones, no discoloration. And here is Mar Marvella. Those are like little seed pearls. So that's really cute. I like that. I would wear that. I think a lot of people would wear that. And you know the holidays are coming up. I think we dress up more in the month of December probably than probably any other time. And this is Raquel. Let's see what. It's a very dainty little chain. Very nice. It's different, it has a little hang thing. Okay. I'm uh, just about done. Here is a, this is marked Jerry's Christmas brooch, and it's in perfect condition. So, okay. This says, oh, this is kind of cute. It's a little, oh, a cute little teddy bear. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? Oh, I bet one of your grandkids or your kids would love that. That's really cute, and it's, again, it doesn't look like it's been worn. That is very nice. Okay, I'm gonna show one last piece. I'm gonna keep it my videos as short as possible. And this is very nice. And this is Casey on it. So, this is the end of my sign um, lot. I have some other jewelry to show, but my next video I will show one of my jars and then even maybe one of my craft uh, boxes that I sell. And I've been putting some craft lots on for $15 for a medium uh, rate, lap rate box and $12.45 shipping. And uh, I need, I have a lot of craft pieces. Since I'm so picky about what I put in the jars, I have a lot of craft. So don't miss out on some of the lots that I have. And thank you for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye!